Hello everyone, welcome back with our RSPS video today. We're back on Runix RSPS, one of the biggest and most hyped Runix private servers out there today. We're going to continue our lovely grind team. Very excited, fast x fast, give away $50 bond as per usual to one lucky winner. Smash the like button, comment your names down below and be subscribed to my channel. And of course, make sure to be joining Runix with the links down below. And I would say, let's get right into the video. We're getting close and close towards getting the lovely Max Cape on the main account right here. I freaking love to see that. We're going to get a couple more grinds going on today right here. I might be going to do some gambling today as well. We're definitely going to do some collectional grinds. And I hope you guys are going to be enjoying the episode. First things first, we got four Dark Totems from right here. Which we're going to go ahead and use right at the bat to kill the Scotties. And hopefully complete in this collection look. One of the crazy most OP things on Runix definitely are those tokens from right here. Which are going to be helping you a lot throughout your grinds. As for example, we're going to be using the Epic Luck tokens in order to grant three times the drop roll on one kill, which means we're going to do four kills in total, which going to count as 12 kills in total. Same also goes with totems for XP right here and so many other things. So using tokens, especially in the harder game modes, is freaking essential. Alrighty, first kill coming in right here and we did not get a rare item. That's very unfortunate. We are missing one item, by the way, the Dark Horn, so hopefully... We gotta be getting that in those next kills. Next kill coming in as well, right here, and again, not a rare one. Normally, we every single kill we use to get a drop on here. It's fine, we still got two to go. Let's go. Third kill coming in right here, and oh wow, I'm actually shocked that I did not get a single freaking on drop here, but it's fine. We still got one more to go. Let's get it, Jason. Hopefully, that's going to be the most important one where we're going to be getting the Dark Hall. Alrighty, next go to kill is coming in as well. That's going to be the final one for the die. Let's see what we're going to be getting. Oh, wow. Right. I am actually... I am hella shocked, boys, but it's fine. Let's check out the collection log really quick right here under the bosses. Go to right now is looking as following. 102 kills in total. That is... Nikolai Slog still missing the dark. Next up, I'm going to go ahead and do some Slayer because that's level 90 right here. Uh, the best thing to do for Slayer, I'm not sure if it's XP-wise, but money-wise, definitely do Brimstone Task. Crazy freaking money maker, early people, mid tier but even like late game people can definitely do that. So what you guys want to go out and do is get yourself the Jelly Task, teleport to the location, kill those. And if you get lucky, you're going to be pulling those Brimstone Keys, which you can sell for roughly 100 mil. It's a couple hours later right here, and we did get ourselves a couple keys. I think it was three in total of like six or seven tasks. I'm going to check out really quick how many we have in the bank right here, because I think I have more than that actually. 15 in total right here. We're going to go out and sell all of those bad boys right here. That should be easily... Over 1 billion cash right here just from farming that one. It's a little bit RNG based. Sometimes you get a lot of keys in one task. Sometimes you go dry for like half an hour. It is really RNG based. But overall, it's a very great money maker. You guys should be checking out. And the price is back at 140 million as we can see right here. So that's definitely over 1.5 billion even. Very, very nice. Also voting very OP. Make sure we support it. The server right here. I've just got myself some free vote tickets right here. I can also go and kill the vote boss now. Which you cannot do if you've not voted. Also, there is these vote streak rewards bonuses right here which are absolute freaking OP. make sure we vote in every 12 hours alrighty boys it's actually the day after right here we did a little bit more slayer grinds yesterday we are 92 almost 93 not too shabby a couple more keys came in nothing too crazy though um we did collect our money 3.4 bill from the last uh, gambling items apparently i've I don't even know when that was to be honest but i'm excited to go and do some gambling today but before we go to the gambling area I want to continue grinding a little bit the crypt because crypt is actually an achievement I want to get out of the way. And we're actually not too far away from it. More specifically, 20 more runs. So I'm probably going to do like, I don't know, three or four runs right now. And uh, yeah, I'll see you with the first lootation. I just had a guy who was actually gambling the exact amount I wanted to go ahead and sash on, which is exactly five bill. So 10 bill in total pot right here. And come on, bros. Can't we just make some money today? That'd be just super, super nice. We did get a lovely pad right here. And that is actually going to be... Is that a boss on his side? It is. Oh, my God. Easy peasy 10 bill into the pocket. All right, here we go. The next 10 bill against Mr. Nefer right here. Let's see how that one goes. G, and we start with a pair right off the bat. That's definitely what we love to see. Blue one right here. Okay, can we finish him? That is... Another freaking bust of him. Are you crazy, bro? That's easy 10 bill profit, right? And we go into the next 10 biller right here. I kind of wish it would have been like 20 or even 40 bill pots right here. But I'm definitely glad that we're just winning non-stop right here. That's the third win in a row. 
You gonna be trolling me, bro. 15 below writing profits, and I, I feel really good about it, bro. Not gonna... Okay, so the man is done right here. We've made 15 more profits. Let's go to the crypt. I might come back later, are they? And actually, the second word just gearing up. We have a lovely Nalico's boss coming up in five minutes, so we definitely gonna go ahead and participate on that one. As you can see, everybody's literally just claiming their rewards right here, and I'm, of course, getting my rewards as well right here. And, uh, yeah, that's fantastic. In, I think it's gonna be in five minutes. He's gonna be spawning. In the meantime, I'm gonna get some lovely gear going. So, apparently, my boy Twist just told me Scorpio Blooper is pretty freaking good on the crypt. So, we're gonna go and purchase that one. But we're gonna do, actually, the lovely uh, Scorpio version. So, we're gonna go and buy all the Scorpio chit in 7.5 bill. It's at no price, but we just won quite a bit of cash. So, we still have 71 bill in cash. So we're going to use those two right here. We're going to get the Scorpio Blowpipe right here. And it's just very OP. Here we go. We have 500,000 Scorpio. Lovely. No, scales actually. Here we go. We've just got the Scorpio Blowpipe. And we're definitely going to use that for the crypt run after the vote boss. And holy shit. Look at how many people we actually have right here to kill the vote boss again. It's super worth it. You guys can actually get yourself a crazy freaking grand pack right here if you get lucky one in twenty five thousand, but also bond caskets and so many other free goodies right here so make sure to be killing every single vote boss right here i think you can also use the epic locks right here to triple the loot so one vote boss is going to be counted as three as we did before also on the lovely um scotezai and yeah let's see what we're gonna be getting good luck to the boys and i did not get anything rare right here but as we can see, three war rewards coming in. So here's a crypt. We have three different, sorry, four different bros that we have to go out and kill. After you kill them, you can loot the chest from right here in the middle. Also, very important to mention is that you can buy those keys from Larynx, which also the cursed caverns. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and complete this. By the way, the Scorpio Blowpipe is doing really great damage, much better than the set we loosed last time, because normally it takes a freaking eternity to complete those runs here. But this one is actually pretty freaking efficient with the Scorpio Blowpipe right here. You guys can see the damage as well. Yo, this is actually quick as hell. First completion right here. Good luck to the boys. And we did not get something rare. I did actually. The Azurius Hood coming in right here. Very nice. I don't think it's a collection log actually. Which is okay. Because we have actually gotten quite a few already. No, people actually know I'm in here. So they might come and PK me. But I'll see you with the next key anyway. Next location coming in right here. And let's have a look right here what we've just got. I think we've just got cash right here and those potions. Not too shy. Alrighty, boys. The next completion coming in right here. And oh, okay. Very interesting. A bunch of keys right here. Not too bad. Let's go for the fourth and final one of Ride. And we've just opened the next chest right here. We did not get lucky, but it's fine. We've got one Zeroes piece, which I'm definitely happy about. And if you check out right here, the lovely uh, mini games, I think we should be finding the lovely uh, mini game in here or maybe under others. Crush Crypt, there we go. And we can say all the different completion. Every single item we get in here is going to be one point for the collection of milestones. So the more points we collect and trace, we're going to get more and more rewards. Yo, I just got to say beat right here the second I teleported. Oh, that's crazy lucky for me right here. Yeah, be careful. There's definitely PKs roaming around the world it is. I've just checked out my reward coffer and we have another dark totem right here, which means we got to go and kill another lovely Scoteezer. All right, the first out of two Scoteezer kills coming in right here. And there is no rare reward and the next kill coming in right here please game yeah we got what is that master task but of course not the item we're looking for yeah you know, one thing i've realized there's those collection logs for box and shit and i think we have a shit ton of boxes in the back right here so i think it's time for a little box open and i just realized i don't think there is a collection log for point mystery box right here which is pretty sad let's see if we have anything else we can open i think we have quite a few things fancy mystery boxes good luck to us right here i'm gonna see how many collection log points we have right now I think 218 currently. Hopefully that's going to change after we're going to open those 26 lovely uh, boxes right here. And oh boy, there's multiple items coming out of one box right here. Damn. Okay, we opened so many and I hope we got one collection log item right here. Let's have a look into this bad boy. Still 218. Wait, what do you mean? Oh my god, this is bad. We've just opened fancy boxes. And we did not get a single of those. There's only five that we can actually get for collection entries. Damn, it's actually harder than expected. Alrighty, time for the ultimate prize boxes right here. Good luck to us. We have not a single entry, I've just realized. So that kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, I'll probably open like 50 of those. There we go. That's the first collection. Like, I don't know, really. We've opened like 25 or so. That's pretty nuts, to be honest. I'm definitely happy we've got one. I did not expect it to be that hard, but apparently it is. But we got to just keep opening right here. The cool part is we can actually buy a lot of those items in the TP. The bad part is we have so many freaking items. That's the worst part. Like, we have so many items back and it's such a massive bank. 
Big F in the chat. I'll see you after opening all these boxes. And the final five boxes right here. Good luck to us, Jace. And I think we only got one entry, to be honest. And yes, it was literally just one. But definitely the cool part is we're getting a shit ton of coins. We got over one bill from these openings right here. Definitely gonna take it. Alrighty, the final boxes right here. And we did not get lucky on the normal price box right here. Seems like there is better loot, obviously, in the ultimate ones. Still, that was really good fun right here for the end. I've actually decided we're not going to go gambling. We're going to do probably a separate gambling video in the next couple of days. So stay tuned for that one. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this brand new video right here on Runix. If you did, make sure you smash the like button, comment your names down below, and be subscribed to my channel. And of course, make sure you're joining Runix with the links down below. Absolute incredible server with endless unique grinds on here. I'll see you online. Have a good one and peace out.